The BSc in Sport Exercise and Health is one of the new courses that we're running here at AECC University College. The focus of it is quite broad, so it's there to give you uh, some understanding and a taste really of a, a, a wide range of the applications of exercise and sport science. Whether that's looking at performance, um, looking at exercise for things like national uh, health promotion schemes, national initiatives, um, or looking at health in general from things like a governmental level, so some of the initiatives and laws which have been put in place, guidelines which get uh, created and released for the public to know what they need to be doing to be the most healthy that they can be. We focus a lot on the research which is there and supporting those decisions that are being made, uh, the processes that are in place as well to make sure that advice which is being given is the most accurate that it can be, but also to identify the uh, some of the testing protocols that get used as well to make sure that the information that we get hold of is as accurate as possible. I mean that our treatments and our management can be as effective as possible for the general population uh, in the same way that we use these things for uh, high level athletes and, and elite performance. In terms of the core subjects, there are three main strands that are covered within um, sport exercise and health. These are physiology, biomechanics uh, and psychology, but also within this degree we've got a large component which looks at things like health and well-being. So like I say, those um, uh, some of the initiatives which exist, but also some of the models that exist that can explain the best ways that we can get these health promotion initiatives across to the public. In terms of career opportunities, as I've explained it's a very broad subject which means there's a really broad range of areas that you can go into whether that's hands-on approaches through picking specific optional units as you go further through the degree you can start to specialize more in the sport performance side of things exercise for health and prescription um, but also health for in terms of uh, health promotion writing initiatives and working all the way up to a governmental level so you can become more specialized as you go through and that will then dictate the likelihood of, of where you're going to go and work. So it could be working uh, with professional sports teams. It could be working um, within the health and leisure industry and hospitals as well. We're starting to see a really big demand for people who are trained in exercise science within our health service because it's a really cheap but phenomenally effective way of managing specific diseases, obviously preventing diseases, but also in some cases, some really extreme cases, potentially providing cure. Um, so you could go and work in those health environments, you could work in clinical environments, uh, we have a lot of people who go and work uh, in schools as well and other coaching roles, or it could be that you start to find yourself developing your understanding of the research and then pushing yourself more into those roles where you start making an impact on deciding what the initiative should be, but also what the national guidelines should be. In terms of the university college, why should you study here? It's a small institution, um, but also a very specialised institution. So you get a lot of hands-on experience here. We have an on-site uh, sport performance centre where you can come along and, and gain experience and work experience or uh, apply to, to be on one of our internships there, working across this whole range of areas. So like I say, with sports athletes, all the way up from uh, weekend warriors all the way to, through to Olympians and Paralympians that we work with here. It might be working on some of our health prescription um, programs that we have going on, or it could just be working on other uh, initiatives that we work on or other studies that we're working on, looking at the impact of exercise for things like health and disease. Um, we've got a big specialist focus and a, a really, really good team of uh, experts uh, in their areas. So from especially those three key areas of biomechanics, physiology uh, and psychology, but also from uh, implementing research as well and, and putting together guidelines. Um, we do have uh, links on a local, national and international level, but that's also reflected in our student base as well, with a really wide range of nationalities uh, represented within um, the student body. Uh, and that means that we have a really unique learning environment here at the AECC University College.